The Alabama Department of Public Health lists 15 counties in our state as having the highest potential for elevated radon levels. That list includes Jefferson and Shelby counties. Radon exposure can lead to cancer. ABC 3340's Diamond Nunnally shows us how you can detect this gas in your own home. Radon is the number one leading cause of lung cancer for non-smokers. 21,000 people die each year after exposure. You can't see it, you can't smell it, you can't taste it. It comes from uranium. It's going to be in the ground. It's from uranium decaying. That's why environmentalist Nick Swindle says it's important to test for radon two times a year, one time in the summer and winter. You could test for radon with an at-home kit yourself, or you can hire a professional. Home inspector Tony Ponder uses a charcoal canister test. Generally, the test goes in the lowest livable area. Ponder says any detection of radon is not good, but when it reaches four picocuries per liter, that's when you need to take action. Action. Well, at that point, they need to get in touch with a radon mitigation company. In Hoover, Diamond Nunnally, ABC 3340 News. If you don't want to hire a home inspector to test for radon, you can pick up one at a home test kits at your local big box store.